Hi, Andrew from MaxiTrans. Today we're going to be talking about the Freighter base model tort liner. Come around and we'll have a look. First of all, proudly Australian made, manufactured in Australia, Ballarat. Care and use instruction decal. QR code, handy little function. If you're ever stranded or don't know where the nearest dealership or outlet is, click on the code, that'll take you to the website. Centre coupling bracket, removable. We've got air, standard seven pin, heavy duty or Euro version, and of course, the mandatory EBS socket. Now, this being a bolt on assembly, you can unbolt it, pull it out, gives you that flexibility to be able to maintain, re-plug, rewire if there is any damage. Also gives you that flexibility to swap them over, provides access when this is in this position from the ground instead of reaching over the prime mover or lead trailer to get access to the centre. So it's a handy little feature, base model on all the freighters. Up front here, corner of the trailer, we have the new improved freight attentioner. The improvements we've made, we've added some additional teeth onto the gear so we can get those extra couple of clicks which provides a nice taut tension on the curtain. We've also made some modifications to the centre shaft as well. Moving down to our step, we've added some anti-slip stair tread which is very grippy, prevents slippage when you're getting access to the trailer. Stainless steel toolbox with provision for a second toolbox. Standard T-handles inside the toolbox. Nice rubber seal, prevents any contamination dust. Door catch straps. Door can be used as a shelf with some of those you know, light bits of equipment if required. Aluminium water tank. We've got the flexibility of being bolt on, so if a trailer is ordered without a water tank, we can bolt it on. Also, if it's damaged, easy to replace. We don't have to weld, just bolt it on. Our new Heller base model lamp. Some of the features with the lamp, we've also incorporated a fully sealed conduit over the lamp for some extra security. Prevents any damage from road grime, rocks, stones, anything clicking up. Get added protection. Moving on to the tyre carrier, the dual tyre carrier, galvanised, rubber bush, takes any of that road vibration around out of the tyre carrier. Aluminium splash panels, front and rear. On the front here, we've got a rubber, braced rubber flap. Brace prevents the mud flap from rubbing against the tyre and getting that wear in the mud flap. On the rear, we've got a spray suppressant mud flap. Just prevents that uh, road line flipping up a little bit of a safety feature, industry standard. On the rear of the freighter trailer, base model, obviously we've got ADR compliant conspicuous markings, but as a feature, we've got two-piece clip road train long vehicle sign. On all the base model freighter, we have a tow coupling provision, so we've got the tow bar in here, air and electrical, the reverse alarm, also again, LED, rear license plate lamps, the anti-slip on all the steps. Moving on to the doors, galvanised door gear, block rods, handles, galvanised, aluminium hinges, stainless steel grab handle for when the doors are open, we can use this as grab handle. Bolt on keepers up the top of the trailer, so they can be removed if required. Rear outline markers, LED. On the roadside, heavy duty rope rail, our freighter iconic tie rail post with a nice rounded edge. Only one in the industry with that nice design profile. Sliding winches from the landing legs to the rear at the front. The first three winches on this particular trailer are recessed just providing that clearance between the prime mover and the A trailer. We also offer a bolt-on accessory bracket. This plate's actually removable. We can fit different valves and gauges. For this instance here, we could fit a raised lower valve. This one's fitted the right way, depending on what the customer prefers. We change this plate. Swinging gate carrier, again, like the tyre carrier, 
rubber bushed, takes a, any vibration out, so the trailer mainframe isn't seeing that vibration. It's absorbed by the rubber. Curtain rollers, we've got a new improved design jiggle roller. It's got a little axle on top of the roller, so it provides a little bit of flexibility between the roller carriage and the roller. As fitted standard to all freighter trailers, we have a two-piece patterned roof track. The two-piece roof track allows the flexibility for the outer roller carriage to be removed if there's forklift damage, tree damage. We've got a three mil steel check plate floor. 25 mil raised combing, so the combing lift is above the floor by 25 mil. Underneath the trailers, we've got SHS floor tubes. As standard base model, we have nine, nine floor tubes across the trailer, the full length of the trailer. Eight mil skid plate as standard. 16 mil to 12 mil main off landers. Also lastly, the Freighter Iconic Bowfront, tried and tested since 2001. We've got the six recesses up the top with the front outline markers and down the bottom provision for a reflector.